Hey there, today we're going to be looking at bibme.org, which is an online bibliography compiler. It gives us four different pieces to work with, uh, APA, MLA, or four different styles rather, for uh, APA, MLA, Chicago, and Turbian. Turbian. There are two very effective ways to use bibme.org, and we're going to be looking at both of them today. So to start with, we're going to just select MLA and let's put in a book number. Here we can search for book by title, author, or ISBN, and ISBN tends to be the simplest. So I'm going to go pull up one of my textbooks and put that right there. Search books, and we'll take the first one here. And you can see it leaves some areas blank. But uh, we can fill those in from the book themselves. This is volume two, edition three. And I don't know if it was published in New York City. I'm going to go out on a limb here and say that it was published in New York State in America. So not too difficult there. And we'll create our citation. And you can see it showing up right here for us. So let's try a different uh, different media source. Click on film and do apologize that I forgot how to type. There you go. And again it leaves a couple things blank, so we'll just go ahead and fill that in. And uh, select that, I guess. And we'll create our citation. And so they're both showing up here. So uh, to then print this out, we would click Download to Word. And it says we have to create an account. So let's click Register. And it would appear that we have to pay for bibme.org and either 10 or $30. So, as I mentioned at the beginning of the video, there are two effective ways to use bibme.org. And we're about to look at the second way, which is to go to your URL and type in easybib.com. Because it is the same thing, it will do the exact same thing for you, and it's totally free. Have a great day.